Hey friends, it's Rhea Michelle and I am back with another video. Sparkle, sparkle. So today I am going to be polishing a few different brass pieces using three different methods. Now they're not super tarnished at the moment or anything, but I figured uh, since I just got them from my aunt, I would give them a little polish and see how these different techniques work. So we are going to be doing a lemon and baking soda mixture, a vinegar and flour mixture, and then ketchup. Since tomato is pretty acidic, it should polish this brass pretty nicely. All right, let's get into it. For the lemon and baking soda mixture, we're gonna start by squeezing juice from half of a lemon into a bowl. Add about one teaspoon of baking soda. Gonna stir that together. And now with a cloth, you just kinda scrub it away and buff out the blemishes. And then with the dry part of the cloth, wipe the residue away. Nice and shiny. For the vinegar and flour mixture, I did a half a teaspoon of salt with a quarter cup of vinegar. And then you wanna kind of dissolve the salt as much as possible. And then we add flour to make it a paste. So this is the piece that I am gonna do. It's kind of tarnished in there, it's pretty used. Just gonna add this paste in here. Make sure it's nice and coated. You can do this with a cloth if you prefer, or a paper towel, but I'm just gonna do it with my fingers. And now you set those to dry for about 10 minutes. So we are just gonna wipe it away. I rinsed it with water and we're just wiping it. it got most of the crud out. Honestly, I'm not even sure if this is completely brass. Now we're gonna do the ketchup polish on this. Basically, I'm just gonna squirt some ketchup on here and you just use a cloth or a paper towel to kind of rub it around. And then you wanna let it sit for just a minute. And now we're gonna wipe it away with a damp one. It is shinier. It didn't really get these marks off very well, but it definitely looks better than when it started. All right, so there you have it. Those three DIY techniques to polish brass. Since each of the brass pieces were different, it's kind of hard to tell which technique worked the best, but they all seem to do the job. So whatever you have in your household, you should be good to go to polish your brass. If you enjoyed that video, if it was helpful to you in any way, go ahead and hit that like button. And don't forget to subscribe so you'll never miss a video from me. And comment down below if you tried any of these techniques, how did they work? And if you have any other suggestions, let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.